Welcome to Cooking for Baby and Me. Today's featured ingredient is bananas, and we'll be making a banana chocolate chip smoothie and Maine wild blueberry and banana granola. Joining me in our Morris Black kitchen is Dr. Karen Taverna Miller and Chef Jonathan Cartwright. Well, these recipes sound great, so where do we start? Oh, we're gonna start by preparing the granola, and this is something you can prepare the night before. Uh, you can have, it has a little bit of shelf life once you've prepared it, so you can have it each morning for breakfast. Mm -hmm. The reason why bananas are so healthy is they contain multiple nutrients that are good for us. Um, one of the biggest things is potassium, which is an important nutrient that we need for our bodies to function normally. Um, in terms of when you're mentioning smoothies, smoothies are such a great way for our pregnant moms to get good nutrition. Um, if, for example, if they have a sweet tooth and they find that they keep craving things like ice cream, this is a mm -hmm. great way for them to satisfy those urges but get healthier foods so that they can watch their calorie intake, watch their weight during pregnancy, and get their growing babies, babies the correct nutrients. Oh, that's such good advice. Right, so what are we doing here? So we're mixing all the ingredients, combining them all together. We've got some rolled oats here, nice blueberries. We've got a little bit of banana that we sort of crushed up. So this is beautiful. I mean, you can eat it like this. You can uh, yeah, it, I was just going to say that. You can even cook it, but we're going to dry it out okay. in the oven. And okay. how do bananas benefit um, babies and young children? Um, well, the biggest is the ease of eating them. Mm -hmm. um, in terms of babies before their teeth are formed, they're able mm -hmm. to digest the bananas without a choking risk. In terms of nutrients, we'd already mentioned the potassium. Um, it's also another good source of fiber for their uh, digestive tract so that they can work normally. So this one, we're just gonna peel the banana mm -hmm. and chop it up if you'd like to do that. We're just adding a little bit to chill it down. And bananas are low in calories and fat-free, so mm -hmm. another great as food to incorporate into your diet. Absolutely, as I mentioned, we're always looking for ways to maintain our healthy diets, our healthy lifestyle decisions that we make, and it's good to have options like this where you can have this for dessert before you go to bed at night rather than getting a big bowl of ice cream or some less healthy alternative. That's fabulous advice. We're gonna add a little bit of milk to it. With the blender, again, I always start just with a little bit pulsing. Really, just make sure the lid is on. Certainly, it is, very, it is very easy. And how's the granola looking? So the granola is good. It takes a, a little, a little bit of time in the oven. How so, long would you say? Oh, uh, about forty minutes. Okay. Also, I made some banana chips okay. a little bit earlier. These are again fresh bananas, but they're like what you get in a packet. So oh wow, they're, they they're look really, like they're going to be really crunchy, mm. like mm. potato chips. So mm. how do you do this? How do you? We make just these? slice the bananas quite thin and then put them out on a baking tray and bake them in the oven about. 30 minutes on 200 degrees Fahrenheit. All of these tips to preserve the produce that you buy is really amazing because I find at the end of the week you have things that start to go bad and sometimes you end up throwing them away and you worry about the cost. That's great tips that you've given us to maintain, use the bananas, freeze them so you can use them later, that it's not wasted. So depending on how, how large a portion of granola you like in the morning, you can um, fill up your bowl. I add a little bit of milk to it, or a beautiful way to do it is actually use the smoothie as the base and then you sprinkle your granola on the top and then you can add a few of these little chips. These look delicious, so let's start with the smoothies. Why don't we all grab a glass? Certainly. Mmm, delicious. So creamy. Nice flavor of the banana. Mm -hmm. mm. And I can taste the chocolate chips a little mm -hmm. too. So yummy. That's good. Let's grab a spoon. Look there delicious you go. on the bottom of the granola. You're right. Mm. That's delicious. Great breakfast on a nice fall morning. <laughs>